Hello, Cecil. Hello, Sir Jeremy. We're playing Red Dead Redemption 2. What are we doing? Oh, this is a cowboy game. Looks like a cowboy game. Looks like none of my wives, far too. So what have you got me here for, Cecil? I thought you might like to watch us play Red Dead Redemption 2 well before we go out. Hey, where are you going? No one told me we were going out. Yes, we're going out to the shops, Paul. Right, why? Well, it's the 8th of November, 2019, Paul, so we've got to do some Christmas shopping, a little bit of advent calendar shopping, perusal maybe. I want to get your mother a main Christmas present. What are you getting a Cecil? Something fancy? Something with sparkles on? Something that she can use on a day-to-day -day basis, but she appreciates and thinks of you every time? No. I was going to get some bath salts. Oh, what's happening? There's some shit, Cecil. Let me shoot them in the faces. Big on with you. Why have we got me here to play the sun when I was going shopping? There's a bastard somewhere, shush. Can't do it in that view. Shoot him in his hat! Right. Can we have some fun with a few fillies? Is there uh, ladies in the local saloon? If you know what I mean, Paul, what? And that's not a wink wink. I'm talking about prozies. Well, yes. It's what they did back then, wasn't it? Everybody had to pay for everything. It's America, that's what it's based on. I'm not going to a prostitute. Not a word of thanks, you ungrateful Yankee. Now, Cecil, do you know if it's a Yankee or not? I have absolutely no idea. Does it matter? Oh, I couldn't care less. So, 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 so Jeremy, I've asked Cecil what life would he lead if he was living in the wild, wild, wild west. Um, he would be a, what was it, Cecil? A cattle rancher or some bullshit? Yes, that's right. A gentle, quiet existence. And Paul would be a snake oil seller. That's right. What would I, what would you be to Jeremy Cream? What? What are you talking about? If you had, if you were in the wild west, what kind of life would you? Lead if you could choose. Uh, I I would run a plantation probably. Would have nothing to do with cattle. Probably uh, own a lot of land, quite a lot of people. Um, sort of being the probably, probably be a, uh, a slave or owner till that was abolished. Then I'd let them go. I'd be nice and let them go. Keep them on if they wanted to. Um, have a few houseboys. What? That's not very nice, Sir Jeremy. Well, it's not nice now. Uh, you're not allowed to do it anymore. Um, but back then it was a perfectly acceptable existence. Good job. Oh, son of a bitch. Well, that was... That was... That was unfortunate. It was unfortunate, wasn't it, sister? You can't own slaves, Sir Jeremy. It's appalling behaviour. Right. So why did you ask me then if what I wanted to do? Because I thought you'd say something like you'd run, you'd be a mayor of something, like a mayor of a town or something, or a 
you'd build a city. Something nice, something noble, not you'd be an absolute shit. It was just the first thing that came into my head, Paul. How was I supposed to know there were other options? You should have known there were other options. Have another go, what would you be? Probably run a plantation or something. What? Why? What would you have me do, Paul? It's what I do now. I pay people there. Oh, look, it's beautiful, Sir Jeremy, though. Look at the game. The graphics are actually quite nice. This is a pretty game. I'd play the banjo. What? What was that? I say if I was in the Wicked Wild Wild West, I'd play the banjo, Cecil. What the hell is this a foot? A bloody foot, literally a bloody foot. Oh, there's all kinds of awful. Oof. A big bloody cloud, uh, shadow. It's another foot. Must have happened. Some, some that's happened. Some bad's happened, Cecil. I've got a, got a real bad feeling about this. Yeah, come look. Can we go into town, please? I want to get some stuff. I might buy Margaret some uh, Dove body care gift package. Oh my God! <laughs> Do you see, Cecil? Oh my Jesus! There's a, a head on the rock. <laughs> this is awful. Uh, well, no. What's this? Me. Killer claw number one. Oof. That's... That's horrible. It's a murder mystery, Cecil. It's like murder, she wrote. But... Terrifying. I hope nobody thinks that was... Me. Is this my horse, Cecil? I thought your horse was... Patchy. If you give us a few thousand pounds, I could upgrade my PC and it'd look even prettier. No, no, thank you. Why would I do that? Because then we, the, the YouTube videos would look much prettier, said, said Jeremy. YouTube videos? That people watch, said, said Jeremy. Oh, right, you get thousands and thousands of viewers a day, do you? Uh, no. Do you get hundreds of viewers a minute? Do you get viewers, Paul? I get absolutely nothing, Sir Jeremy. This, nobody's interested in videos we make anymore at all. I'm not entirely sure anybody watches them other than me. Right, I certainly don't watch them. No, no, you don't. Nobody comment. Well, the, maybe two or three people comment on them. Maybe if I'm lucky. Right. I'll stop making them then. Oh, okay. I'll stop that now, shall I? I'll stop having a hobby or or anything, shall I? Well, yeah, why bother? Putting all this time and effort into something nobody's interested in. I'm expecting Cecil to chime up and oh, and say he's interested in them, but he's just... You've gone to sleep, Cecil. Yeah, it's a little bit. It's just taking too long. It's taking quite a long time, isn't it? But look at how beautiful it is, Cecil. Just look at it. It's like a Halloween, but... A fun Halloween, not a spooky Halloween. 
Tis in it, I can imagine Jack Skellington running through these trees. Yes. Going, what's this? What's this? There's something very wrong. What are you buying your mother for Christmas? Oh, I might buy her a, a dove. Uh, or or uh, some kind of bathroom care kit. What do you mean? The shower gel combination with um, a bath bomb. She'd hate that. Don't get to that at all. No, Kate Ellis, she's wanted. Dear Aubrey, A woman? Where are you, dirty bitch? Women generally are found near water. Are they? Yes. Cleaning the smalls. Right. Shit it. Hey, 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 shh. She just, Jesus Christ, she just stabbed her son in the neck. Yep, you nasty bitch. Stabbed me right in the heart with her sexy womanly ways, with her womanly wiles, and a big fucking knife. Ow, Cecil, don't say fucking. Don't you say fucking. Stop it. <laughs> but, I thought it was dead or alive. I thought it was dead or alive too. Maybe I lost her with thirst. Hog tire. Put her on my arse. Not him, not him. Don't hog tie him. <laughs> well, that's one way to save his life, I suppose. Don't you shoot me, you shittingtons. You son of a bitch. Well, this is going very badly, young kid. I'll just let her murder him. She seems to like doing that. Oh shit, she's got out. You nasty bitch. Alright, get on me arse, you silly car. I will manhandle you. That's exactly how I'm going to handle you. Oh bloody hell, I'm going to have to walk her back. Bugger. Oh, bugger her, Paul. That's, oh, that's a horsey there. Take that one. She's a bad un. Oh, she's a bad un. Maybe she'll shout at me and with colourful language. But as we ride through the night with my bounty. Oh, she don't, she don't know what she's done. Paul just hit her. Oh, don't, oh, Jesus, he did not. I didn't think he would. <laughs> Ought to keep your woman folk quiet. Just don't do it in front of the servants. They'll, uh, they'll look at you, your school. You do have an illness, love. You were shit. Sanatorium. Leave me be. Shut up, Cecil. She is trying to twist your mind, Paul. Don't let her get under your skin. I won't, Cecil. Don't worry about it.
Meh. Yeah. Maybe. Nah. Right. Steering me! Oh, touch that button. It is a beautiful game. I'll stop saying that, Cecil. I know it is. That's why I wanted to buy it. That's why I stole your credit card and bought it without your permission. I'm just going to be a cowboy life now for till Christmas. She might bite your bum bum. She might bite your bum bum if you're lucky. Excuse me, Sheriff. Yes. She must be very bastard. Jeremy. Jimmy me money. Jimmy me money. Twenty-five dollars. That's rubbish. <laughs> 